Okay. Welcome to Talks with My Dad. Um, and this is part two where we're discussing this wonderful book called The Three Questions. Based on Leo Tolstoy's uh, story and written and simplified by John Moth. Yeah, it's wonderful. So, Dad, why did you want to share this story with me and everyone else? Uh, what I like about this book is that uh, Leo Tolstoy wanted to write a book for the children and in a very simple way to explain uh, the philosophy of life. And mm -hmm. And many people, they have these ideas about uh, when and those three questions and yeah. when is the best time. Let's remind them, what are those three questions? Three questions were this boy, Nikolai, wanted to find out when is the best time to do things and who is the most important one and what is the right thing to do. I'm going to repeat that just to be really clear. Mm -hmm. When is the best time to do things? Mm -hmm. That's a really good question. Mm -hmm. Who is the most important one, what is the right thing to do? Mm -hmm. And according to the characters of uh, Nikolai's friends, that one who was very free-spirited and the other one was very uh, military type of person, Pushkin, and uh, said, oh, we need a pack, we need organizing. And Sonia, who was very perfectionist and said, everything has to be planned ahead Plan of time. Planned in advance. In advance. And then the, the monkey, Google, was just about like... Goofing around and you know, just being... have fun. A, yes, have fun. Yeah. And that's the most important thing for, for Google and that type of person. But in this book, is that examined that in a very beautiful way that uh, there should be a balance. And also... Uh, going to the fact that you know some people they uh, about time and a lot of people they live in the past oh mm -hmm. once upon a time life was good or yesterday was so beautiful everything was what was safe nice peaceful wonderful and many people also they say one day I will do this one day I will have that one day we will yeah. um, go and have a better life and always they live in future. When I get that job, we'll have more time with family yeah. or when this happens. Yeah, absolutely, just... absolutely. But in this book, he's saying that how important to the best time is now. It is, is the right present now. Time. Yeah. Don't lose it. That's all you're certain of. This is the only thing we're guaranteed absolutely. is right now. Absolutely. The past is uh, gone. Yes. The future is not guaranteed to any of us. Mm -hmm. As the saying said that uh, the past is history, mm -hmm. the future is mystery, and the time present is called present because it's, it's a, a gift. gift. Yeah. yeah, and that's valuable. We it's have so to valuable. value it. And I think a lot of people are discussing that and awakening to that awareness of how important living in that and the mindfulness of being conscious of mindful living in mm -hmm. in the moment. It's so powerful. Yeah. yeah. So it's great that this is a children's book. Um, I mean, but it, it has so much depth into it. Yeah. Into was it originally a children's book? I mean, it's based on a story by Leo uh, Tolstoy. Tolstoy, but but again, Tolstoy wanted to write for you know uh, for children. Mm. I I I'm the three assuming, questions. Yes, the yeah. three questions. But in one one way is again the second question comes that who is the most important one? Mm -hmm. We look far away to see who is the most important one, yeah. and we're forgetting the family members, friends that we are with, mm -hmm. our closest friends, and sometimes we treat them badly, mm -hmm. and we take for granted, and all the time saying, oh, you know, uh, you know, such and such, and far away, and we are imagining that person is the most important one. Yes, you can have that person uh, who is, even though physically far from you, mm -hmm. Being very important very to you, important yeah. to you. And yeah, of course, dear to you, to your heart, family, and to or, absolutely, yeah. and we, there is no uh, um, uh, argue with this. Mm -hmm. But at the same time, not forgetting the person who is close to you, treat that person well. And I totally think that absolutely means if that's the cashier at the checkout at Fortino's or wherever you're shopping, smile at that that's person. the most important person in your life at that moment. Absolutely. Because Treat they're right there, right. Yes. right here, right now. That's the most important person to you. Yes. That person, the people on the line with you, mm -hmm. those are the most, as much as you love your mom and dad yes. and your friends, mm -hmm. in that moment, if you treat those people as the most Badly. important people mm -hmm. in your life, mm -hmm. 
You'll have such a miracle and you make, wonderful you make life. You make such a change in the world. Huge and change. Because if you fail to treat them well, that, that opportunity is gone. Mm -hmm. That chance that you would treat these people fairly with dignity yeah. is gone. Yeah. And we should treat people well when they are there present right then with you. Because no if we don't think of them as the most important people, we just think of them as strangers or people in line, we don't give them as much of our awareness, our, our heart, our kindness. Um, Attention. It doesn't mean that you know, you're know you a bad person to everyone, even mm. if you don't treat them like the mm. most important person. Mm. We're not saying that. But making that shift into actually making them the most mm. important person in your life, I think is really being the change we want to see in the world type Absolutely. shift, right? The emphasis is there. And yeah. uh, so bringing that emphasis makes it so uh, wonderful and powerful mm -hmm. and it is and it is easy easy to mm -hmm. do not to forget the one that you're right now treat that person as the most important person yeah and if if, if for example again that the a cashier somewhere if if they themselves were treating me like the most important person not because it's their job and they have to smile and you know that comes across as phony but they actually meant it Imagine the, the warmth, uh, that, that, the that, that transfer, yes. that relationship that, that happens there. It's really priceless, Absolutely. that gift, right? Absolutely. And also, the third question, which is mm -hmm. the most important thing to do, is the task right now. What's the question? What is the right thing to do? Mm -hmm. And the task that you have in hand is the most important thing to do, is to focus on that and take some pride. And I see some people that uh, for whatever the reason is, maybe they're cranky that day, they don't uh, like their job, maybe they don't take pride in their, mm -hmm. whatever they do, the job that they're doing. Yeah. And that's a shame because if whatever we do and say, this is the most important things right now I, I'm doing, and I should put pride and uh, energy, my best into it, mm -hmm. uh, that's again, such a big shift in our paradigm yes. of seeing things and this um, how wonderful it is it's really being and mindful it. even yes. if you're just doing dishes and you make that the most important right thing important to thing to do because that's what you're doing at that moment uh, then you, you become so aware of that right here right now moment and uh, I, I think it's just such a huge shift in our consciousness mm -hmm. if we all did this Absolutely. and and in, in this story where he's helping the turtle dig mm -hmm. and that's all he's doing is in that moment the turtle says at that time what you were doing was, was the right thing was to the do. right thing to do because he was helping him that was the right thing to do the right thing to do wasn't to go save the panda at that time because that's just not what he was doing at that time Absolutely. that was mm -hmm. for another time mm -hmm. so and when it came to mend uh, panda who was mm -hmm. injured that was the most important things to do right things to do to help that panda at that moment at that moment so this book is so much about being aware of the right Everything. here right now mm -hmm. who what when where why in the now mm -hmm. absolutely it's so powerful yes i hope you guys also enjoyed this book as much as we did so hopefully that while you're watching this video we were the most important people in your life because you are the most important one right in our life to us. right now which is yes, kind of funny because right like yes. right now is another time for you right now Woo, maybe we don't know illusion, you but... maybe we don't know you but we know you right now because yeah. we are looking at you thank you for thanks watching for this thanks for joining video. us okay thank you Bye. and au revoir see you next time I like the end that was like Ooh. yes <laughs> right, right now